Yet again, in another case of where are your parents, 20-year-old Ivani Reyes is being criticized on TikTok for claiming that she accidentally sprayed Gorilla Glue in her hair and now can't remove it. Gee, wonder where we've heard this one before. I'm gonna break down all the details on this TikTok Gorilla Glue copycat in a moment, but first, if you could please smash that like button, we would really appreciate your support. And with that out of the way, let's talk about this sticky situation, shall we? A TikToker, as I mentioned, is being accused of spraying glue in her hair for clout and cash after a woman from Louisiana went viral for actually doing this by accident. In her case, she was attempting to use the permanent adhesive to set a certain hairstyle. Avani's incident comes just days after Tessica Brown had flown out to Los Angeles to have the Beverly Hills surgeon, Dr. Michael Obeng, dissolve the grill glue on her head, a procedure that would cost her $12,500. At first, Ivani posted a bunch of TikToks showing her beauty dilemma with the first video being her trying to comb through her crop pink hair that clearly looks like it's covered in a thick layer of glue. Rhea says later in the clip, you guys, my hair will not comb, she said, gasping multiple times as she patted her head. Y'all, I tried wetting it. That video has since been viewed well over 1.3 million times, however, many are having a hard time believing that this was indeed an accident. Multiple comments said, you knew that would happen, don't pretend you didn't, cloud chasing. While another responded, people will do anything for a bit of money. With another adding, I'm pretty sure you did this for more likes, views, or money. Someone else then commented, I've watched your videos clearly showing you can read a bottle. So far, Reyes has more than 450,000 followers and has posted a number of follow-up videos going to the hospital as well as trying at-home remedies to remove this permanent adhesive. Apparently, just like Brown had to do as well, Avani underwent the four-hour procedure to have the glue dissolve. Reyes said in another clip, I'm on my way to the hospital right now. My scalp is burning. I need to go to the hospital so they can remove this Gorilla Glue. I have no idea what to do. I tried washing it, it doesn't come off. Avani then seems to enter into having a panic attack, but even that people were calling an act. The strange part, I suppose, is just the constant uploads updating us on all of this. Again, Reyes notified her followers that the healthcare workers that were treating her in the hospital were confused as to what to do, and all Reyes said in response was, I hope they figure something out because my scalp is burning. Tesca Brown had already been through all of this, you know, including that trip to the emergency room. So when we see Avani being annoyed with all the hardworking hospital staff, it kind of makes you question her motives. As reported by the Daily Mail, Reyes said in a Another clip. I just got out of the hospital and they did nothing for me. Look at my hair, she griped, saying she was advised to try olive oil, tea tree oil, or coconut oil, or to remove the glue or shave her hair off. Now, as predicted by the numerous comments I read out earlier, Avani also decided to start a GoFundMe page, much like Tesca did. Tesca Brown was able to raise almost $24,000 to pay for her medical expenses. However, her doctor ended up performing this procedure for free, and he even somehow was able to save most of her hair. Tesca, the mother of five, though, is now planning on donating the money she raised to the Plastic Surgeon's Charitable Foundation called Restore, which provides free reconstructive surgery to those who really need it. I also would be remiss if I didn't share with you the official apology from Gorilla Glue. In a tweet, they said, We are aware of the situation and we are very sorry to hear about the unfortunate incident that Ms. Brown experienced using our spray adhesive on her hair. This is a unique situation because this product is not indicated for use in or on hair as it is considered permanent. Our spray adhesive states in the warning label, do not swallow, do not get in eyes, on skin, or on clothing. It is used for craft, home, auto, or office projects to mount things to surfaces such as paper, cardboard, wood, laminate, and fabric. We are glad to see in her recent video that Miss Brown has received medical treatment from her local medical facility and wish her the best. I mean, it's good that they're at least following her story. Bizarrely enough, this has started to become a trend with some people even using the hashtag Gorilla Glue Challenge. Again, TikTok, stop with the challenges. We're in a pandemic and our frontline workers don't have the time to be dealing with stuff like this. With that though, let's check out some of your comments from the video titled, We Need to Talk About Chris Harrison. Joshua Cook says, thanks for covering this. By the way, I look forward to when you do your videos because we either get smooth dress Johnny or this Johnny who isn't afraid to show his Goosebumps collection. I love my Goosebumps collection. Never afraid to show that off. That's one of the benefits from working from home. You guys are getting a little bit more uh, personal flair from me. <laughs> Erica says, Johnny, all the love from Africa, Ghana to be precise. Wow, all the way from Ghana. Much love to you and thanks for watching, Erica. CL Briarly says, I misread the title and thought at first it was going to be about Chris Hansen. I was thinking, are IO really going to be like, just have a seat? If I do, uh, we need to talk about Chris Hansen. That is a great opening line. So thank you for that. Jojo Burger 1215 says, racism is wrong in any lens. Big facts, Jojo, big facts. Doesn't matter what lens, it's racism. Racism bad. EB says, so much drama in 2021. I know, and we're only two months in. Well folks, that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. I've been your host, Johnny Rogers, and until next time, stay classy, YouTube.
I'm gonna break down all the details on this TikTok Gorilla Glue clap. <laughs> <laughs> what a tongue twister that was. I set myself up for failure. <laughs> Let's try that again. Dry need water.